All right, I'm going to get into this Coach Legacy ED Perfume review. So I'm going to start out by saying that this perfume was actually originally released in 2008. It is now a discontinued fragrance. They do have a fragrance out called Coach Signature, and I'm not sure if that is uh, similar or not, but uh, this is a discontinued fragrance. I did find this fragrance at Ross Dress for Less, and because it was a Coach fragrance I've never seen, I went ahead and bought it. But now that I know that it was a release originally in 2008, that's probably why I have never seen it because it is old and it is now a discontinued fragrance. So I'm just going to put that out there before I start this review. So like I stated, I found this uh, one ounce at Ross Dress for Less in the fragrance department. And this is the bottle here has the little coach label on it and then the top has the coach label on it as well and then this is just a plain uh cardboard box here and then it has the coach labeling around it and this is the one ounce here all right this up here all right so as i said before this fragrance was originally released in 2008 it is described as an amber floral which is a very accurate description for the scent so the scent notes are mandarin guava honeysuckle jasmine and the bottom notes are sandalwood amber and vanilla so when you first spray this perfume you do get a little bit of that floral and a slight bit of citrus but it's, it's very the fruit is very very slight you get the floral more uh, but the floral is very tamed down because i smell more of the bottom notes the sandalwood and the amber when you first spray it on so when you first spray it on i completely agree with what they're calling it an amber floral because that is exactly what it smells like but i will say it's more so 30 percent 20 or 30 percent floral and then the rest would be more amber so this is more of an amber ford scent okay on the dry down on my skin tone i get pretty much all amber and like 10 percent of the vanilla in it so the vanilla does help to sweeten up that amber some the fragrance is long lasting on my skin this is a good fragrance um, for day and night. It's not so amber heavy that it would be too much for the daytime. And I think it's also good for people who say, um, you know, the perfumes don't last on their skin because it has amber in it, which is kind of a, a heavier bottom note. It does pretty much give you some good longevity. Um, now, are you going to get eight hours of longevity out of this? No, because it's not a super heavy amber um, influence in this fragrance. It is more so in the middle. Not a light amber, but it's not a super heavy amber. It's it's right in that middle. Because like I was saying, you could wear this fragrance both day and night. Uh, I think it might pair well with Bath & Body Works Into the Night Body Cream. Uh, use that as your, your base and then put the coach legacy on your pulse points i think that they would pair well together um i also want to say i agree with the, what they call this fragrance um it kind of puts me in the headspace of like chanel number no. five where you know that, that that is their flagship fragrance you know by them calling this legacy that puts me into the mind as well like okay this is coach's flagship uh scent you know it's, it's very uh mature and sophisticated like what they want their brand to be known for just like chanel number no. five you think of that you think of luxury you think of sophistication you think high end so i think by coach calling this legacy and the scent notes that it does have in this fragrance was the right title for this fragrance because it does put you in the mindset okay 
that this is a modern, sophisticated lady here, okay? She she is not too fruity. She's not too floral. She is about her business. She is ready to go to the office. She is ready for to go to happy hour. She is ready to go to the lounge, okay? You could be very versatile with this fragrance and it fits well with the brand. You know, the brand coach can be very versatile. You know, they are trying to be known as modern and sophisticated. So I think also the perfume title was perfect for this fragrance as well. So I wanted to point that out. Overall, um, it does hit the mark with amber. So if you're an amber lover and you want something that you can wear day and night with the amber in it, this is a go. And that is a, would be all for this review. I really do enjoy this fragrance where sometimes amber can be hit or miss for me. But this one, I actually enjoy it in this uh, scent because it's not a super heavy amber, but it's not too light to where it kind of wears off fast. It actually does kind of linger around for a decent amount of time. You're not going to get eight hours out of it, but it doesn't disappear like after 10 minutes either. So thank you all for listening to my review on the Coach Legacy ED Perfume. And I hope you guys enjoyed it and have a wonderful day. Love you. Bye.